Um, hi, Kevin. Hi. Uh, so did you know that NASA is planning to send astronauts to the moon in 2024? I did not, know. Uh, so what do you think about it? Um, I think it's actually pretty awesome, you know, just to uh, explore, you know, what's out there and, and uh, you know, just see what's in the universe and all that and what else besides Earth we have to, you know, to, to live on. Um, but you know, I think it's definitely a, a good place to try to, you know, to do that and, and uh, just explore for our kids and for everybody else from that. I, do you think at some point um, humanity will expand and uh, like to the rest of the solar system and Earth would just be one of many places we are? Probably, yeah. I think so, yeah. yeah. Um, so if it was safe and affordable, would you go to space? I, I think I would try, you know. The biggest thing, I guess, is, you know, you see a lot of movies and things like that, and you look at the time lapse and things that do happen, you know, where, and, and it may just be movies, you know, for the most part, you know, where people go and they come back and it's, you know, years later and your, your kids have kids and things like that. So that's probably a little scary part of it. But, you know, it does take, you know, uh, uh, time travel, things like that to, you know, to, you know, go through the universe and get through all that. So I, I would say, yeah, um, maybe later in life, um, you know, but I guess you figure out what you miss, you know, in life itself. Yeah, that's kind of interesting. Your kids have kids. I mean, if I was to meet like my great, 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 great relatives, I don't think I'd feel any closer to them than I would a stranger. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you definitely wouldn't know them, though, even though they're kin to you, you know, but things like that do happen, you know, so yeah. Well, uh, Kevin, I really appreciate it. All right, thank you. Thank you.